Okay, well, I've uh, I've spent probably uh, a couple hours laying down in the, the hammock with the under quilt and the top quilt over me. Um, it's getting a little bit warmer out. It's probably in the 40s right now. Um, not too bad. Um, well, uh, for the most part, I mean, it, it seems to be a, a pretty durable, uh, good hammock. Um, it's definitely not an asymmetrical hammock, but it's got the width. It's at uh, the single plus... Uh, hummingbird and it has the width to uh to go a little asymmetrical in it uh, that pushes your feet uh a little bit out of the uh the uh the under quilt uh, uh so if you're going to do that you're probably going to need some pretty good wool socks you know to, to help protect your feet a little bit um but for the most part uh, it seemed to be comfortable um i did feel a little bit of uh hyperextension on the back of my legs in there uh you can turn a little sideways i turned a little sideways in it and it uh, kind of got rid of that or across your leg under the other one um for the most part when i had my hammock the hammock i had before the uh war bonnet blackbird xlc was uh was a hammock uh you know straight line hammock like this uh more of a banana uh, hammock type deal um excuse the shake and i have a central trimmer so i just uh, shake all the time um but for the most part uh, it was pretty comfortable uh, I, I do believe i'll be able to sleep in it uh, overnights and stuff like that and, uh, and this thing will cut uh, two pounds off my uh, deal there was a i felt a little bit stretching when i was in it when i first got in it but uh, you settle right in uh, i don't see uh, any issues issues with it uh, you know sticking me to one spot i could move myself back and forth in it and slide myself up and down and uh, it seemed to be pretty comfortable so uh, for 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 now uh I'm going to give it a, a thumbs up. Um, I can give you a better review whenever uh, uh, I go on my uh, overnight this next weekend and uh, I sleep in it all night long. But uh, between uh, you and I right now, uh, I don't think there's going to be an issue with me sleeping unless the hammock just fails for some reason, which just looking at it and the feel of it right now and everything, I, I don't think it's going to fail. I've, I've, I looked at some reviews that said that uh, they split and People have hit the ground or this or that, but uh, I don't see this thing splitting. It's pretty tough. It's a pretty tough hammock. Um, I bought this hammock uh, uh, secondhand off of somebody who uh, bought it to uh, go on a hunt. And I think he used he said he used it once or twice. And then they ended up sleeping in their vehicle. Uh, I don't know if he just didn't have an under quilt or what he had in it or this or that. But uh, I ended up uh, getting it off of him. Uh, with the uh, straps for for a pretty good deal um, but uh, I was going going to order it off of uh, of uh, hummingbird but uh, I ended up catching this this one online and uh, met the guy and uh, purchased it but, uh, I'll uh, I'll go on the hike this weekend and uh, I'll let you guys know uh, how it all pans out um, here's my uh, I think I had it inside out earlier because I I did wash it and, and dry it with some tennis balls. Uh, here's my top quilt. Uh, and I ordered the under quilt, the hammock gear under quilt. But, uh, and then uh, there's that Yukon Outfitters uh, under quilt, which seems to, to do pretty good. I've got it attached at the uh, the ends up here, and it seems to, to fit it fairly well. It, uh, I had it pretty much set to fit my, uh, my uh, war bonnet. And... Uh, Anyway, uh, I'll go on the hike this next weekend, and uh, I'll post another video to to uh, to let you guys know uh, what I think about the uh, the overnight uh, deal with it, how I feel after I get done with the overnight, and uh, I'll probably even send a, a couple of these videos to uh, Hummingbird because I didn't see too many videos of people uh, that have done overnights in them, you know, any 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 overnight reviews. So I'm definitely going to try to get them an overnight review and and. Uh, let people know about these hammocks because for 7.6 ounces and then uh 1.5 or 2 ounces depending on the, the length of uh whoopee straps you get with it and the straps so the straps are pretty pretty neat little material this is the short one which is a little bit thinner strap the uh, longer one has a little bit wider strap but it comes down you get these these right here and they wrap around the tree i've got it wrapped around the tree up here and it comes down and then the whoopee is attached to it down here at the bottom and then you know everybody knows how whoopee if you've been around whoopee whoopee uh slings for a while they're just a chinese finger trap type deal 
anyway uh for the most part uh everything seems to be working good with it uh i'll give you a better update uh probably let's say uh probably sunday afternoon or or monday uh after i get done with my uh weekend hike y'all have a good one and uh god bless